Hello and welcome back to another video on the old Golden Black YouTube channel. I'm Tom Rouse and it's the day that we've all been waiting for. Ruben Neves has been confirmed as a Wolves player alongside the new away kit, which is a lovely little black number. Um, he signed a five-year deal at reported around £55,000 a week, which is a massive, massive outlay for a championship team. But that shows the real power that Fosun have got financially and the pull that Nuno has got as well over players that he's managed in the past. So hopefully this could be the start of something else, something new, something fresh and something amazing. The other news that has been released by the club today is that Willy Bolly has signed on a year-long loan. There are reports as well suggesting that that deal is, a, is could be made permanent in a year's time for around about 12 million euros, depending on, of course, if he wants to stay and if we want him. Because of the number of centre-backs that we've signed over the last few weeks, I think what Wolves fans are starting to think is that we're going to play it with a three at the back. So we've really got Bennett, Miranda and Bolly alongside Hawes, Iorfa, Bart. There's lots and lots of centre-backs now, which gives us lots of cover and lots of options, and if there are injuries, there are replacements for them. So I think that it'll be interesting to see the system, and we'll, we'll get a chance to see that next Wednesday with their first pre-season game out in Austria. And the other piece of news is that Wolves are acting quickly in trying to replace Carla Kimi following the devastating news on Thursday. And it looks as if they've secured John Ruddy on a free transfer, which is an amazing signing, considering he was on the verge of signing for Sunderland, but we've managed to steal him by the looks of things. I think I've rated him as a goalkeeper. I think when I heard that Norwich were releasing him back in May, I highlighted him as a possible challenger for Akimi. I didn't see him replacing Akimi, but he's going to be able to add something to our team and, and be a solid number one, I think, with Burgoyne possibly as a number two, as I imagine that uh, Lonergan is going to be leaving the club. So to come back to Neves, he was talking on the Wolves YouTube channel, he was saying that he's always wanted to play in England, he loves playing with Nuno, he's going to get the opportunity now to show himself as a top player in England and even if he uses our club as a stepping stone, I think the sign of him is going to allow us to keep Helder Costa. I think that I talked quite a long time ago now that Wolves need to sign a big marquee signing, a Portuguese player who is going to convince Costa to stay. And I think we've done that and now we can start building a team around Neves and Costa. And I expect there to be a striker coming in soon, hopefully in the next week or so, possibly even before the team go out to Austria on, on Monday. At the moment, striker op striking options are still fairly limited. So hopefully that will change soon. Thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to check out the links in the description down below. There is one for the bone marrow register. Go and read about that and find out about that. If you're fit and healthy as well, there's another link to go and book a session to give blood. And while you're there, you can find out more about the bone marrow register. Sign up for the bone marrow register. You could be a match for somebody with leukemia and save somebody's life or give them the treatment that they need and with what's happened at the club recently I think it's very very important that all Wolves fans go and, and do that and all football fans in general I think. Thank you again for watching, don't forget to hit like, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.